Kama Gayatri Mantra Rupa Haya Krishna Swarupa Sarda Chabisha Akshara Tara Hai Se Akshara Chandra Hai Krishna Kari Udai Rijak Gat Kaila Mamai Okay, one, 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 one more, more, one more. One before, Gurudev. Oh, yeah. Now that before is with the eyelids on the creator. That one. Yeah, yeah. Atati yat bhavan ani khana anam rutiya yuga yatitvam apashyatam utila kuntalam shimukam chate yada utikshatam pakshmakritrisham mm. O oh Krishna, when you go to the forest during the day, and we do not see your sweet face, which is surrounded by beautiful curly hair. Half a second becomes as long as an entire age for us. Mm. And we consider the creator who has put eyelids on the eyes we use for seeing you to be simply a fool. Mm, I do. And we consider the creator who has put eyelids on the eyes we see for using seeing you to be simply a fool. The creator is a fool because he has put the eyelids. We cannot just look at you like this. We have to put on and off. This is uh, spoken by the gopis in Srimad Bhagavatam. But that day was different start. Yeah, that is the next one, Gurudev. Krishna, the Supreme Personality of Godhead, yeah. is identical with the Vedic hymn known as the yeah. Kama Gayatri. Yeah. That's 125. Yeah, which is composed of 24 and a half syllables. Those syllables are compared to moons that arise in Krishna. Thus, all the three worlds are filled with desire. Desire. So <laughs> this is Krishna, who is a basic word. Read again and explain that. Krishna, the Supreme Personality of Godhead. The Supreme Personality of Godhead is not Krishna Bajendananda. This is different Krishna, Narayan Krishna. Depend upon the worshipping. We worship Narayan Krishna, Dwarka Krishna, Brajendra Krishna. Hmm. I know everybody will not understand, but this is the meaning in here. Yeah. Krishna, the Supreme Personality of Godhead, is identical with the Vedic hymn known Vedic? as the Kam. Vedic hymn? That is a Vedic hymn. Vedic hymn means, hymn means what is the meaning of hymn? The hymn is a glorification of the Supreme Personality of Godhead. Yes. Mm. 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 Yeah. And 
Krishna, the supreme personality of Godhead, is identical with the Vedic hymn known as the Kama Gayatri, which is composed of 24 and a half syllables. Yeah. Yeah. Those syllables are compared to moons that arise in Krishna. Thus, all three worlds are filled with desire. Oh, Gurudev, <laughs> meaning of this verse that um, how who is uh, meditating on this Kam Gayatri, it's different to whom he speak. So one yeah. who, who is doing the Vedic hymn, mm. he is uh, calling to Narayan, Vishnu. Yeah. yeah. And um, one who is uh, uh, man in Manjari Bath, he is calling uh, not this Narayan, Krishna, but this, uh, what you said. Our explanation coming. This is only for Narayan, who Vedic him, then is a calm Gayatri like this. So, different meaning, no. different understanding. So different understanding. One is this and another is that. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. go on. Next verse, huh? Mm. Mm. The face mm. of Krishna is the king of all moons. Oh, and the body of Krishna is the throne. Thus, the king governs a society of moons. Yeah, they but, do but. Oh, sorry. Ah. No, go, you go ahead. Thank you. Yeah, here Sanskrit, the first word is Sakihe. Is this meaning uh, this word is uh, sp spoke by Radha? Sakihe, first word is. Who is speaking this Sakihe? Ah. Krishna Mukka, Kubijara Jaraja. I want to know because the English translation is uh, unclear. Hmm? What is that? Unity? Yes, good. If the Kushori would like to know the Sakihe of the verse, it is, is if it is spoken by Shimati Radhika. I don't know. I want to know from you. Is, what is there? What is I mentioned? think, yes, it is mentioned the face of Krishna is the king of all moons, and the body of Krishna is the throne. Mm. Thus, the king governs a society of moons, and in the purport, Srila Prabhupada writes, Krishna's face is considered the king of moons, and his body is considered the throne. <laughs> All the other chandras or moons are considered to be subordinate moons. His left cheek is a moon, and his right cheek is a moon. Ah. His forehead is considered half a moon. Mm -hmm. His forehead is considered a half moon. But her, her question is Sakhi A. I think there? because they are gopis, it is a verse, it is spoken in the in the context of Srimad Bhagavatam. So they are all gopis speaking to each other about the beauty 
of him. And so they are in Saki bath. But maybe someone is saying this to Shimata Radhika, but it is not mentioned. No, there is written somewhere. I can check in the next one. No, but where Kishori is asked, ask from Kishori where to be. Yeah, this Did you is find it here? As Krishniti Didi. No, you have to see if you find it somewhere, good if seeing. Yes. Um, so because yeah. I see this bus 126, first word is Sakihe. Before uh, you you said uh, this is a Narayan Krishna, but from this 126, first word is Sakihe. Here mood is changed, but English translation unclear. No translation about Sakihe. That's why I'm asking. If possible, I want to know. I think we could not say that it is Srimati Radhika. But what is the scene in Srimad uh, Bhagavatam is all the gopis are there to worship Krishna and they are all looking at him as is, if he is the you know, personified Cupid or beautiful, most beautiful love God. So mm -hmm. then yeah. they worship him like this. Here is some word, Sakihe, I want to know that. Yeah, it is word. In the verse, it is Sakihe. It says, translation, oh dear friend. So I think they are the friends of the girls, of the gopis who are saying this to each other. Sakihe, oh dear friend, Krishna Mukha, Dvija, Raja, Raja. And then they say this, the face of Krishna is the king of all moons. And the body of Krishna is the throne. So it could be any Gopi Guru. But of course uh, it could be also Swami. Uh, read the Bangla. Bangla means Sakhi He Krishna Mukha Dvija Raja Raja Krishna Vapu Singh Hasani Vasi Raja Shasani Kore Sange Chandrera Samaj. So she is right, Sakti. This Sakti here. The Radhika is standing to all Sakhi. Our Sakhis are telling to all friends. Sakhis are talking with the parents. No Radhika, because they, Radhika is also there. In Mona. So Sakhis is explaining to all, we are like, like a friend explaining to the friends that I see these moons here. Very clear. Thank you so much. Is the Singhasan place of sitting in this moon? This moon sits here in this body. I think in Srimad Bhagavatam it doesn't become clear who is speaking because Sukadev not mentioned the name of Radharan. This is like conversation of the gopis. So one gopi telling to other gopis, Saki, hey, hey, listen, my friend, and then talking about Krishna. But yeah. We are fixed in the Radharani, so we always can think that my Swamini is speaking about him. No, Swamini is not speaking here, because Swamini is also moon. 
the first are speaking to about the moon, about the Kama Gayatri. Mm. So Sakhi means friends. One, we are like sitting here, we all are says my friend, my brother. This is Mana, we are shared like this. So see, they say that I see the moons and moon and sitting place also there. Again, read in Bangla. Yeah. Krishna Mukta Dvija Raja Raj hmm. Krishna Vapu Simhasane. It's a Srina Mukha. Mukha means face. With the moon. And Bapu is a sitting place. Hmm. Singhasan is a sitting place. It means like the beautiful face of, of Krishna is sitting on the throne of his body. Yeah. Yeah. Mm. Yeah. Yeah. Go on, Gurudev. Yeah. The face of Krishna is the king of all moons, and the body mm. of Krishna is the throne. Throne. Throne, what is you said? Throne? That is the Krishna Vapu Singhasane. Singhasane means a sitting place. What do you say in English? No? Yeah, they, 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 they translated Singhasane on the throne. Because the throne. king. Throne is a. Mana. This is the head, no? Mana. But here, Singhasan means Singhasan. Singhasan is a sitting place, chair. Mm. Go on. Yeah. Thus, the king governs a society of moons. Mm. 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 So they yeah. they compare. They say that his his face is the king, and his body is the the throne. The whole, you know, the whole beautiful seat of his face and his whole head is on oh, that right. throne of his beautiful oh, body. Right. And thus, yeah. the king governs a society of moons. Yeah. yeah. No, no, no. Yeah. Are you better? Be? Yeah. Yeah. Better. Yeah. I'm here. I have to buy phone. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Again, read the purport, Gurudev, or continue? Yeah, good. English. Krishna's face is considered the king of the moons. Yeah, king of the moon. Yeah. And his body is considered the throne. Yeah, okay. Mm. All other chandras or moons are considered to be subordinate moons. Yeah. Mm. Yeah. Singhasana is also where, where lions sit, no? Mm -hmm. Seat of for lion. Steve. Yeah, sitting. They are laying, laying, laying down and this. Yeah. They are. Yeah, bed and sitting place. Comfortable place yeah. of the king. For the king also. Yeah. And for queen also. Yeah. Queen also. His left cheek is a moon. 
Left, left, left side, it is. Swamini. Left, left is always Swamini. Bamangini. The Hindi, they say left and right. Bamangini and right hand. So Bamangini means as wife, lover. Bamangini. Beloved. Above. Mm -hmm. And his right cheek is a moon. His left cheek is a moon and his right cheek is a moon. Yeah, see? And his forehead, his forehead is considered half a moon. Uh, you see, the forehead is half. Why? My question is this. Forehead is the main thing in the face, right or not? But why is half? Mm. Forehead meaning also fortune. My forehead makes my fortune, right? My future, my my thinking, my ideas make the future. Vision it's also, a, vision, huh? also vision. vision, vision. Yeah. Third eye. Third, Third eye. eye. God forehead and his heart. Why? My question is this, answer this. It's also imagination, Gurudev. No, the forehead means the future, the, the, his, his, what do you say? The wishes of the Krishna. It's ah. the heart, in the control of half. The half is on top, Gordon. <laughs> no, half means the, the good luck of him. He's in the control of half. Today wow. he will be lucky or not. It's all controlled by half. So his forehead is a half. His fortune is today there is or not. It all depends in half. And who is half? Radha Dasi is the half. Manja. Manja. Ah. This is the fortune of Krishna. Depends on Manjaris. Hmm. Hmm. But deep subject and depend on Manjaris. Wow. That is. Mm. Where he will meet or not meet with Radha, it depends upon the how. Uh, yeah. mm. His forehead, his fortune depends on how. Wow. Yes, Nanda Maharaj. Mm. <laughs> yes, you have to meditate it. Hmm. Interesting. Go on. Go. That is the Rasika meaning Gurudev is giving. His forehead is considered a half moon. You see, I'm not telling you. Is it already there? Read. Yes. But you are giving the feelings for this Gurudev. Fortune depends up in the forehead. My fortune. Yes. In my forehead, right? Mera bhagya mein likha hai, wohi kehte hai na? Hindi mein kya kehte ho? Bhagya mein likha hai, what is written in your forehead, it will happen. You cannot change it. He's a half in the control of half.
not in his control. His forehead is considered a half moon, and the spot of sandalwood pulp on his forehead, forehead is considered a moon. Do you see? <laughs> that is full moon, and the forehead is a half moon. <laughs> Fortune is a, a half, and forehead, this tilak is the full. Confirmed, Gurudev. The mandras make the good fortune. Yeah. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and his fingernails and toenails are also different moons. Yes, no. Oh, this is like this. Oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Mm. Next one, yeah. Gurudev. So here it looks like that Krishna alone is 24 and a half. If you count the nails, each is an, it's already 20, and then in the faith. Yeah, because it's the Kama Gayatri, it's a 12, 12, <laughs> no, 24 and a half. It's a whole Kama Gayatri and it's compared with Krishna's body. Mm, yeah. But like Gurudev will reveal to us, also mm. Swamini is in there already because we know that in Kama Gayatri is Radha and well. Mohan together. They are together. They are in the divine embrace. Ah, this, is, this is slope measure. I'm showing this is slope. Read and you will see that. Why left and right? This left mm -hmm. and right is a two chick, meant two person. Yes. Like uh, two eyes is two, Radha and Mohan, and two hands is also two. And two feet are also two. And the forehead is half. And one is lakko. What is the meaning of one is lakko? One, one lakh and one lakko means one pointed. Wow. Ekadasi. Ekadasi is meaning brata ekadasi. And second meaning one way. That mm. is also. One dasi for Srimati Radhika. No, one dishi. Dishi means disha. Oh. One way. Way means disha. Mm. So one way is ekadasi. Who fits one, one No many god. That mm. is understand ekadasi. Others they do for their benefit. Ek lakho. Ek lakho means one lakh. Right? In a Bangla, ek lakho. And one lakh also, and one pointed is also ek lakho. Who has many points, two points even, he is not aiming right points. That is ek lakho. Under, you understand him? You know now? Yeah, I know. Sumita, I know. Sumita, Sumita, Sumita. 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 One way of life, one way of goal, the spiritual or material, both will not go one to This is two way. One way means one pointedly, one fixed my goal, that I need my sarup, that is one way. 
I want to be in the material sense enjoyment and a spiritual. This is not one way, two way we are practicing. Krishna has two cheeks that shine like glowing gems. Both are considered full moons. They are not half full. They are full. They are parallel. Parallel, yes. Mm. Like the two eyes and the two cheeks. And again comes the forehead, Gurudev. His forehead is considered half a moon. Yeah. Before it was in the explanation of Prabhupada, this half moon, he, explain, he explained this, no? This was in the explanation. It was not in the verse, but now it comes in the verse directly. Half moon. Calling about the when he's talking about Manjari, and we don't know that half means Manjari. That's the point. Wow, wow. This is also for the next verse. Is the only explanation he made. It's interesting to see this, no? <coughs> step by step. Mm. Mm. So I really try to understand that point. It's a difficult subject. So outside it looks that we are only talking about Krishna, like 24 and a half moons, Kama, Kama Gayatri Mantra. But Guru can yeah. explain deeper meaning that inside of that, Already Radharani is there and Manjari is there. Is that correct, Gurudev? Yeah. Or not? Right. Hundred percent. Okay. This is the, the meaning of Kamagatri. This is the Bija Mantra of Kamagatri. But only for those devotees who practicing Manjari Bhav, for for those who practice Saki Bhav, then then Krishna is twenty four and a half. No, no, no. Oh God! Our Gauriya Siddhant is this. Of course. But and other, I, no, I have no idea. <laughs> Very good. <laughs> above <laughs> I'm not a researcher I, I I'm not a philosopher that I ca collect the information I do and I know that yeah open 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 no this man no Oh, I the In the modern psychology, there is this brain, this part of the brain is also uh um for the desires they find out that all the desires are there right so this is half this is the desires are not full is a half my brain is working till the my desires are not full yeah and it depend on me when yeah. my desire is full then it will be full <laughs> so i have a desire but it's not full. Yeah. The moment the desire will full, 
then I will think full. So this depends on half, right or not? 100%. Not in, yeah, this is the point. What of half? Even the Lord creator desire, it depends upon the half. Wow. And our house. <laughs> <laughs> Wow. Yeah, so yeah. I feel so just Gurudev says Gora Chandra Prabhu also says as a Shastra has not mentioned this half because uh, if worship Narayan Krishna, it's Supreme Godhead. He don't need to fulfill uh, desire by others. He can fulfill his desire by his himself. But Brajendra Nandana is just uh, not Supreme God. They need help. That's why our God Yavashirava found this half moon. I feel it. Is this correct, Gurudev? If you, if you are considering he is a Supreme God, then he's okay. And when you consider him like a Brajan Nandan, then okay, your vision will be, you will be same, but you will see different way. Person different way saying, and different desire. Different desire and different as receiving information, you will receive different. Way. You will not like, because you like Narayan, so you will not like to know about Brajan Nandan. If you like Brajandan, you would not like to listen about Narayan. Like a Gopa Kumara, he traveled many places, but he was not happy. Right? He has to, he like Krishna to play, Krishna to eat together, so he not interested in the Bakunta or Indra Loka, other things. Right? He travels many places, right? So, depends person to person. We are talking what is mentioned there. I am not talking any words of outside. No. Go on. Love it. Krishna has two cheeks that shine like glowing gems. Mm. Both are considered full moons. His forehead is considered a half moon. And the spot of sandalwood is considered a full moon. It is surprising for me. Head is half and the spot. The luck I do is a full. My God. Very surprising, Guru. <laughs> when I was reading it before, I was puzzled. I cannot understand. I have no access. But I by your mercy, Guru, now. I can rub it with the water, is a full. And what is my head is out. <laughs> this is the interesting subject. <laughs> what you like you put. Of any cream you put, you can clean it, right? But this is full, half. Head is half. And the spot in the head is a full moon. <laughs> yeah. Beautiful. That to realize, meditate, go on. But the spot also has a meaning, no? It's a. That I said, uh -huh. meaning. Yeah. Meaning is there. You can only find in the Vilapu mm. yeah. It's a Kama Yantra. Kama Yantra. Yeah. But, but Vilapu Manjali will explain it. Go on. Rather. It's also many, many full moons, but only one half. Yeah. I think I want to bring ice cream. 
Well, always remember one lecture mm -hmm. they gave. We were so, reading. But the top I still ah, Song Maduram Maduram. Maduram. Maduram Maduram. And then Guru Dev immediately stopped. You see. They're starting direct from the face. No. Not face. Adharam Madhuram, lips, talking from the lips. Yes, Guru. This is one thing, but it's a lips word. It's starting from the lips. I wanted to make the point that they're not going to the feet, like you approach to the Narayan. If you approach the God, then everyone give prayers and dhanava to lotus feet. And then they look up. But you made the point that no, this is not Vrindavan mood. This is God. But Vrindavan is direct, going to the face. And gopis, Radharani, direct to the sweetest. To the lips. There is no Aishwarya Gyan. There is this Leela when Krishna disguises himself like a Narayan. No? And the gopis, they come and they understand, oh, this is God. So they give pranam. <laughs> oh, Narayan, nice to see you. Can you tell us where Krishna is? Like this. So the realization of God's sweetness is much higher than the realization of God. <laughs> so I like that because we start reading Adaram Maduram and then Gurudev immediately he go there. You see, <laughs> this is Vrindavan, direct to the lips. Not to pranam to the God and the lotus feet. Yeah. <laughs> Very soon. Yeah. Sorry. Yeah. yeah. Read more, by His fingernails are many full moons. And I dance on the flute in his hands. Their song is the melody of that flute. His toenails are also many full moons and they dance on the ground. Their song is the jingling of his ankle bells. The all song in the universe is flute and ankle bells. Flute is the the mallow. Mallow is the sweetness, one flow of the person. The person mm. is growing because one mallow is in the family. Any growth, any progress you see because one mallow in the family. And the rhythm, the drum is also with the mallow. Bina taal ke sur nahi nikalta. So taal asur ek hona chahiye. Pura ke. But देख लो जहाँ तरक्की है जहाँ संपत्ति वहाँ सुमति ना ना जहाँ विपत्ति वहाँ कुमति बिना कुमति जहाँ है वहाँ बस down तो मेलो and the rhythm is the only thing the whole universe is growing on that mellow a flute of Krishna and rhythm of his ankle wells 
is all progress if we are start listening our ear is lucky to listen this there is no hope for any problem go on when suniti start reading today there in the beginning there was the explanation of kaam gayatri that this the whole kaam gayatri explains and going on my dear all oh, mm -hmm. and it's kaam gayatri explanation yeah go on krishna's face is the enjoyer king that yeah. full moon question how he can be enjoyer Well, what he want to enjoy? If the things are only he is alone, God, then what he will enjoy? One boss is in the big empire, eh? and no one is there. What he will enjoy? No one was there. Kingdom is there. The king is there. but there is no no public no so no anyone in the family what what boss will enjoy what he not he he is not enjoy if is in the kingdom nobody is there nirvana <laughs> <laughs> he is a real enjoyer because the kingdom is very big <laughs> that to understand he is the real kingdom and he is the real enjoyer because we are all in his kingdom in his mercy living because we are far from his mellow and rhythm that is our problem if we believe in the in the mellow and rhythm of is fluid and ankle bell we will always success right or not <laughs> then we see his empire and his kingdom then we recognize his kingdom of love Krishna's face is the enjoyer king. That full moon face makes his shark-shaped earrings and lotus eyes dance. His eyebrows are like bows, and his eyes are like arrows. His ears are fixed. on the string of that bow and when his eyes spread to his ears he pierces the hearts of the gopis of the gopis you see here what i cannot say <laughs> yeah what is meaning of gopi you know meaning of gopi that female bahut achhi baat keh rahe hain sun female what is the nature of female enjoyed by male is a female and who has the desire of enjoying female if a female i am a female and my desire to enjoy then i am male or female male male sure. <laughs> why we want to enjoy because of this plastic body gross body we want to enjoy <laughs> so we are all male 
we are all well because we have a desire to enjoy. Show me any female who has no desire to enjoy. Enjoyed by enjoyer. This is the female. And make happy to the enjoyer is a female nature. Right or not? She think such a way. But male nature atta. Why male nature is coming? Because of my discovered body. So who is gopi? Gopi means who realize that I am a soul and I am a cons my consciousness position to enjoy, not to enjoy, to give the enjoying to the Lord. Krishna. This is the pleasure. This pleasure to Krishna, service to Krishna. They are gopi. It's not this gopi bhav is a feeling of gopi. Male can be gopi and female can be male. Outside male change the clothes to become lady clothes is not bhav. Nothing to change outside and inside. Feeling has to change. That is Gopi Bhav. Your feeling, what is your feeling? That brings me there. That's it. Yeah. With his flute song, he attracts all living entities, meaning he attracts all the souls. And the souls, by nature, they are female. He not attracts the body of everyone. He attracts the soul. Very nice. That is female. Yeah. And, and what? this attraction yeah. is being enjoyed. By him. One thing I want to add. You say, listen the song of the flute. This is only mystic fear. The moment we will start listening is, is from this ear, then my ear will become divine. My feelings will become divine. My thinking will become divine. I can see beyond my material body other things, higher things also. Right? That is the thing. That is the beauty of life. Right? Okay, sorry. Go on. Next verse, it is the. Uh, we are now in verse 130. The dancing features of his face surpass all other moons and expand the marketplace of full moons. You see, marketplace, not. One more, many more still market. That is the meaning. When we enter in the divine, then we see real reality of the divinity. Wow. Many marketplaces is a place where meeting many come together. Yeah, and this but, is not material marketplace. Yeah, this is the moon marketplace, divine market. We have many markets, supermarkets, see, and you are in Europe and America, you see, but this is the divine market.
you will see that full moons and who desire to be with them. Mm. They are associated. But still one half moon is there, only one. Who fulfill that forehead is a forehead of Krishna. <laughs> <laughs> that half nothing is completed. My wishes complete by half. Radhika Dasi complete half. Even Krishna desire complete by half. Hmm. Yeah. He is also never full, and he is full, and same time not never ever full. I'm not making corns. Yeah, I should to make it to corn. I'm not even right. Yeah. See that. That's not so easy to understand, Gurudev, that there is one who is same time half and same time full. So there is desire, because of this desire, he is only half maybe, and at the same time he is full, there is nothing uh, to desire to him. It's not so easy to understand, right? Yes, my dear. <laughs> yeah. Right. Achintya Veda Veda Tattva. <laughs> Both things at the same time makes him divine. Yeah. Oh, no, I think he is full of desire. He is not satisfied. <laughs> he is full of eagerness, full of desire. It's like the king of the throne of his body. So in his head, in his eyes, in his smile, in his eyebrows, there you always can see amorous desire is there. He is oh, not set. He is not for his, his desire to for love. Much? And all his body is like Visa Man. Second, they are working for that. No, his hands working. For that, his feet, his dancing, everything supporting the desire that is seen in his face. And as Guru Dev say, the fulfillment of his desires, the fulfillment of his meditation, <laughs> what he's thinking, what is his desire? It's here in the third eye. It depends on the how, on the help of the mother. But the conception that he is God and satisfied and same time not satisfied, I think it's not matching to the mood of Randan. He is always full of desire, never satisfied. And who is giving him this desire? That is the question. Yes, you know, you know, enjoyer, enjoyer is never satisfied. <laughs> no. Yes, they are drunken, Gurdi, in honey wine. Lade. <laughs> no, <laughs> yeah. That's it. You are right. I fully agree with you. So, if you is the enjoyer, then you don't know the meaning of enjoyer. He never satisfied it. You only want to enjoy. Yes. 
You become in joy. Nobody can satisfy you. Then you will have to be God one day. <laughs> and if you're not God, then you're gone. In joy, never satisfied. Now there. So today we started this about uh, Kama Gayatri. I stuck to one thing about the verse 125. It's written, Kama Maya. Oh, it's <laughs> just a kind of promise that we did it. It's good that they also said. Mahamaya. We see word to word by Prabhupada, Kama Maya is full of desire. Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> this is the beauty of Kama Gayatri, I feel it. Kama Maya. I hope it's sorry. It's, it's, it's here. Kama Maya. Krishna is totally Kama Maya. <laughs> this is Kama Gayatri. That's why he needs half a moon to fulfill his desire. That's why yeah. Kama Gayatri is important why? for my people. Rather. Devotee become devotee, not become Krishna, not become enjoyer. Wise person is this, that you become devotee of Krishna, not try to be an enjoyer like him. You will be in problem then. <laughs> you will never satisfy. Then you like to be a god. But to be a devotee of the god and make satisfied to him because he never satisfied. And if you want to be a god, then you want to enjoy and you never satisfy. <laughs> ダイホー。ありがとう。ありがとう。ありがとう。ありがとう。ありがとう。ありがとう。ありがとう。ありがとう。ありがとう。ありがとう。ありがとう。ありがとう。ありがとう。ありがとう。ありがとう。ありがと
his desires, calling Radharani. When Radharani listened to his flute play, she wanted to respond to him by playing her veena. So she catch up with his sound. So they play together. He expressing his desires by playing the flute. She is responding to him and also say, saying what she feels. But finally, Baba writing so beautiful, Radharani start going one level higher. She start outplaying him. Her Vina play becomes so beautiful that Krishna cannot catch up anymore. And he become astonished. His flute fall down. It means, in that connection, it means by his flute play, he can express feelings and his desire. <laughs> she is capable by her love to create newer and newer desires in him. Ah, I don't know that. <laughs> we don't even know that he has that desires. So he becomes so astonished that his flute fall down. That is what Gurudev just said, that from where is this desire for enjoyment in him is coming? It's coming from her. And she does that in a way that he don't understand himself, how it is possible. Oh, I think I explained very nice. <laughs> uh, <laughs> Yes, and that, uh, Gorajanna, we will also be uh, feeling confirmation in the next verse. So we should continue until we come to the next verse. Now, Gurde, can we continue? Ah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> so, although priceless, the nectar of Krishna's face is distributed to everyone. Some purchase the moon rays of his sweet smiles, and others purchase the nectar of his lips. Thus, he pleases everyone. A smile means distance. Lips means very close. Ah. What? I come close, but I'm still distance. It's a smile. <laughs> From distance, people smile, and then I feel well. So nice. And who is pleased with the lips? Man is very personal. He never satisfied without lips. One is a wine. One is a wine. When we take wine, many are taking wine when they want to forget what they are doing. Right? And then one taking more adding in wine, they add tea. 
if you add in wine D, what is happen? What is the word? Say loudly. Divine. Yeah. So this divine, then you will stop taking wine. No need to say anything. The moment you get the drop of divine, you will not drink drop of the wine. Crazy. If you are crazy, then you will take. Yeah. So, divine. And when you want to drink honey wine, honey wine, then you will forget divine also. <laughs> one is a smiling and one is a relation with the lips. That is honey wine. Rather, understand. These are the stage. We are material state. We are happy with wine. When we want to grow more high, we need divine. And we want more divine is not tasteful. Like drugs has a position, one pack drinking, he needs ten packs to drink, then he has a something happening, five packs. And then he starts taking one injection, heroin or this, then LSD and this, that, then they feel good. You know, so in a spiritual life this is happening. When you grow from the divine and when you taste the honey wine, then you forget divine also. So smiling lips and smile, there is two things. It's a good position that we see the lips the smiling of you. Is it divine? <laughs> but honey wine is more higher. There. This is Vrindavan. Why Vrindavan? People are crazy here to come. It's still summertime. I'm surprised. So many people in Bihari here, so many in Vrindavan. The, all the road is stopped to enter and come and out. Krishna has two reddish, widely spread eyes. These are ministers of the king, and they subdue the pride of Cupid, who also has beautiful eyes. Yeah, you see two eyes. Krishna has two eyes. Why you say this? Naturally, one face has a two eyes. No, no. Acharya is having something else. What is in Parkiya? One person has two eyes naturally, but two faces are here because <laughs> one is Krishna. And one is his energy face. Are Anyone is not powerful without his energy. Bhaiya, tum ho atmari ye energy hai, shakti hai. Dono jab hoge, tabhi powerful hoge. If Krishna is Krishna, because of the energy of Krishna. Here, Rasika, 
acharyas are thinking, writing that these two eyes, two face eyes, is this. Rasik will understand who is not Rasik, they will see two eyes, Krishna. Only Krishna he will see. Sí. No, <laughs> 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 Oh, 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 we came to see St. St. Francis Church. Wow! <laughs> so good! So, so this, this is the Rasika. Who is writing this book, Chaitanya Chaitamrita? Krishna Das Kavira. You see, highest Rasika. Who opened all all the confidential knowledge and how we can understand without understanding Vilatko Samajini. This is the mercy that we can understand Chaitanya Chaitanya. And it's a very high elevated. Uh, go on. That face of Govinda, which is full of happiness, is the home of the pastimes of beauty, and it is very pleasing to everyone's eyes. So that is so beautiful that Vishnu was now revealing to us. The Rasika Vaishnavas, those who have the feelings of Dasipa, especially now in our Gaudiya Vaishnava Sampradaya, the Dasipa, they see in Krishna's face always Swamini and Krishna or Mohan together. So she is also the Cupid and they are always in a embrace. That's why also in our Kam Gayatri Mantra, Gurudev is revealing to us, it is always that they are in Ananga. Who can see it like this? Who can feel it like that? Only the mantris. Because the mantris, they always want to bring Radha and Mohan together. They always want to bring Mohan to Radhika and Radhika to Mohan. So they also feel the whole Kama Gayatri as them together, always in Ananga. And that is the explanation or the meditation of Kama Gayatri in Manjari Bath. And if I don't have this bath, if I didn't get it, then I will be seeing Krishna as Narayan, as the Supreme Personality of Godhead, and the mantra in that way. Or if I am in Gopi Bath, I will see. Krishna as the you know personification of Kamadev himself, and I will say as a gopi in that soul consciousness to the creator, why did you create these two eyelids? I want to stare at him all the time. So these are the three levels that are possible in this Kamagayatri meditation, or depending on our realization in our feelings that we have gotten. But Manjari is always see Radha Mohan together 
And here we have this also in this verse. That's why we wanted to come there. That face of Govinda, which is full of happiness, is the home of the pastimes of beauty. Is the home of the pastimes of beauty because Radha and Mohan are always dancing together in that Kama Gayatri. And it's very pleasing to everyone's eyes. And to Uhu's eyes, it is especially pleasing to the Dasi's eyes because they are there always checking. When is my service time coming? When are they calling me? What is Swamini needing right now? What she wants now to please Mohan? What can I serve? So we see, uh, I said to Gurudev, that also in the meditation of Kama Gayatri, we have a three levels of Abhideya, I mean Sambandha, like first we start like in the servant's level, Abhideya, once we have the soul level and prayojana, when we are in that mode of the dasi and we want to serve Shrimati Radhika and Mohan in any time, in any circumstances, then we will see Kamagayatri as their embrace and they're always in that embrace and that divine Leela. And there's always a lot of honey wine in that. Radhe Radhe. Correct, Gurdi? <laughs> yeah. That was the the mercy that we got on on Wednesday in the uh, Italian class sharing and today Gurudev again giving us all that mercy. Oh, sorry, I'm sorry. This is Jananda program, but he asked me, I said. Wonderful. Uh, he's, uh, he's enjoying. I see him relishing, Gurudev. Mercy of him. <laughs> I want no, when he was coming I will think he will meditate and he will not accept like this. It's not when he will feel and he will realize then he will agree. Yes, please and share, Jainanda Maharaj. I'm talking much too much. I'm I'm sorry, I apologize. No. <laughs> no, today I'm 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 listening, hearing your wonderful kata. And uh, I was meditating this expands the marketplace of full moons. So Guru mentioned Radhika expand expands the market. I was meditating Mahaprabhu expand this marketplace. <laughs> Mahaprabhu all that. <laughs> to expand this marketplace of Harinam. So this I kind of, you know, I just kind of, both Lila is kind of uh, combined this marketplace. This, this Namahata. <laughs> so, because Radhika does not go go to outside Vrindavan. So and Nitai, who is representative of Ananga Manjari, actually Ananga Manjari represent of Shurimati Radhika, especially outside of Vrindavan. So so Nita is Ananga Manjari also expanding. So just I am just feeling, you know, this Manjari, Manjari or Manjari expanding. Rupa, Rupa Goswami, Sanatana Goswami, Rupa Goswami, 
and Raghunath Das Goswami. They also expand this. So many, so many manjari expand this, this Unna to Jaru Rasa, Guru Daiva. Rasa, there is only one Rasa. This is only one Rasa. Only one Rasa. This is Mahaprabhu want to give us, this, this is a mercy. And also Mahaprabhu also Nitai invite us to join us. Guru Dev's word, please taste this uh, honey wine. <laughs> and this is a representative of Ananga Manjari. It's like a Guru, Guru Manjari, it's business. So our, all, our business also try to uh, cooperate, try to help this our Guru Manjari and to please Radi Radhika and Radhika's Moha. So that's I felt. So by the mercy of Gurudev and Sriniti, Gora Chandra, and also Kishori. So I I directly here. <laughs> Thank you very much. Now your class, what is your normal class? Please, about half an hour is left. No, today is uh, our Gora Chandra to try to share with them. Okay, okay. Gora Chandra. Sorry, I take his time. <laughs> Everything oh. okay, Guru. Was beautiful. Better than everything. But I want to add something. The passionate love of Radha and Mohan expand all the time. In the beginning of the lecture, Suniti explained that the karma, the karma deva, expanding, it fills the whole creation with desire. But what is that de de desire? This desire is pure desire of transcendental, passionate love. That is what Jayananda just said. No? It expands. It wants to be expanded, distributed, give to everyone, that every soul, jiva, can also participate and also nourish it and grow it eternally. But what happened in our material consciousness, this pure desire of passionate love turns into material lust. But even in this material world, every passion, every material desire, everything that we love, money, position, everything, the root of that is the pure desire. It's the pure passionate love of Radha and Mohan. And I like that Jayananda so beautifully explained <laughs> that the Manjaris and Nita and Goranga, they are coming <laughs> to remind us, no, no, <laughs> not the material passion. Turn it back to the spiritual, transcendental, passion of desire.
So, but it's good to remember that every desire, every passion that we have in material consciousness also, that the root of that is the passionate love of Radha Mohan. They are the center of all creation. Everything expands from them. Spiritually and also the material creation with unlimited universes. It never stops to expand. <laughs> and also, like Jayananda explained, the distribution of that pure love <laughs> also never stops. Always Acharyas will come. Always the Manjaris of Radharani will come and bring it to all the Jiva. We only misunderstand where this desire of me is coming from. What is the origin of passion? Yeah. I don't know we should start now something else for the day. Please share something. More. <laughs> no, Jananda Maharaj is the after <laughs> It was the uh, realization come inside this I explain that maybe it is wrong. I know claim that is all right, but I feel that I share it. Jananda Maharaj will approve. I uh, I accept when Jananda Maharaj approves. What are you talking about the Guru Dev? Whatever you say comes from your Guru Dev. Para Guru Dev, you know, I accept. I thank you. It was good realization of me. You're, you are super than me. No, 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 no. What are you talking about? I just follow Guru Dev. My position is, you know, follow you, you know. Uh -huh. I just. Uh, my business, I, my business. I I respect you in this matter. No, 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 you, no, no, no. No, 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 no. You you show me that Mahaprabhu brings very special things. I don't know before that. No, 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 Guru Dev. I my business fatoeba fatoeba remnants. You you said I try to explain. That is my I business. You, my dear. I'm your student. No, 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 no. I'm your student. I'm <laughs> student of all, all of Vaishnava. I'm most, you know, nonsense guy, you know. I, um, I'm, I'm following, you know. You're hiding. You, you cannot hide from me, man. I know you from 18. I know. Kalavati, both are special. Kalavati may, may be special, but uh, not me. <laughs> no, you are special. You, you, it's not easy that in three months you are going to complete your uh, highest degree and you leave my words. This is the speciality of you. You are a great. <laughs> No no, 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 I'm, I'm lowest. I, I, from me. I don't I just, know, Tasta. I was just bhajan, 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 but you give me many, many inner realizations. No, 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 I'm just, uh, just a philosopher, just no. information corrector, you know. Rasik, you are Rasik, you are Rasik, I know you are Rasik. You are Rasik. 
you have a mercy of Narayan Maharaj. Suniti has the mercy of Narayan Maharaj. Radha Charan has the mercy of Narayan Maharaj. They are, they are, they are Kripa Patra of Narayan Maharaj, but not, not, not me. You are Rasik, Association of Rasik, Lord Govinda Maharaj. You are Rasik Association, always you be. Prabhupada, how they are Rasik? If not Rasik, how they are writing this in the book? We are not qualified to understand that is different. But all of your association, I'm learning every moment of my life. <laughs> so I'm learning from, you know, Suniti, Gora Chandra, and uh, Story, everybody. No, no we will be happy when we are together in Vrindavan again. Yeah, we are very happy. We are very Gora happy. Is really special. Yes. yes. This idea. He has his own idea. And yes, this is I agree. after Japan, he has realized. <laughs> Japan land make him realize. <laughs> this grass action, he want to be a sannyasi, renounced person. But when he becomes grass, he is more realized. This is amazing. By your mercy, Guru. <laughs> this is a real amazing thing for me. Amazing. Gopinath said to me that he gave advanced service of um, Patit Pavan, advanced seva for one year. This so, is amazing. This is really amazing. Who can do this? And no. we got Nitai now also in Jamna. Nitai also there. Wow. Yeah. You see that? We you need to we... You saw the temple, how beautiful you make it. Wow. You see the temple, how beautiful. It's no less no, than... No, I see I support only little. But... By mercy of Patit Pawan, now this temple become more famous in the wow. area. Wow. People start coming and start giving donations to make some floor a little new and this and that. <laughs> now flowing also from other direction, Guru Dev. And he's the he's the, the real real seva there. One time, <laughs> Gurudev, I asked him, Gurudev, what to do there? What should I do in Jamna? He said, you only do your bhajan. This is missing. Nobody, nobody doing bhajan there. So you bring this mood, braja mood, you bring there and only you be there and do your bhajan. Then everything will happen. <laughs> wow. So wow. it become true. Like nobody is practicing Manjari Bhav there. Nobody has mood of Rundavan, no? <laughs> so I only do little bhajan there and somehow is working. <laughs> Guru Dev. Jai Guru Dev. Jai Guru Dev. And Gaurav Sundara is coming tomorrow. Today is his flight in evening time. He's yes. coming. Yes. yes, his driver arrived, Gurudev. His oh driver. my God. Oh my God. Oh my God. I was thinking, you know, Gaurav Sundara is there. <laughs> my mama. Now just, now just driving to the airport with Manohan. Wow. Manohan is also today. He is also a seeker. Yes. My yes. son is very elevated soul. Yes, very I'm elevated. Six, six <laughs> elevated soul has got blessings yes. to come. He has a one good quality. He only 
are healing people with sambandhakya. To help the Lord in the sea of gifts, sambandhakya. And this is his, his name I give Sanatan to him because he is the part of sambandha. I don't know. Yeah, I don't know. Yeah, I don't know. He know how to develop relations. That is a real Sanatan means it was, it is, it will be. So this is the eternal truth to develop relation and relation make everything in life. You see that Gaura Chandra, he developed relation with Patit Bhavan. And his life changed. Practical example is Gaura Chandra. Relation makes you closeness to listen the flute and anchor bell of Krishna. Blessings. Ready, God. This is yes. Oh. oh, Garuda is ready. Seva, Seva car is ready. <laughs> wow. So we are so happy. Wow. Come soon, Vrindavan. Jananda, wow. you also have to come now. <laughs> now? <laughs> yes. I wish to I wish to come. But <laughs> <laughs> I like to meet you. Yeah, I you. also. Me too, also. But I have a little obligation. After that, I go. I go. <laughs> Maybe next week then. You are going to make the have a program in uh, <laughs> Europe. Two weeks you are staying only. Wow. We have uh, yes. We are so happy to have program. Yeah, we are welcome good friends from Japan. And yeah. Ma, Dr. Hibagiri, he will come yes. back to come and get you from the airport. <laughs> yeah. So, so please yeah. take care nicely. <laughs> yes, and all the people. So nice. What a, what a great month, the June this year. My God. And July, Prashant Vahya is raising to you. Coming also? Yes, now they are in Italy. So nice pictures from there. In July, we all meet Mahima Bhaktigiri. We will meet also with Prashant Vahya and Rasa Lila and all Japanese devotees. Wow, very nice. Very nice. Yes. We have a few months. Wow. Also, uh, he invited, uh, what's his name? Uh, Vishwananda. Oh, for wow. For example, yeah. Wow. Very nice. Last moment he got the visa. <laughs> Friday he get the visa and Monday he has to fly. <laughs> or Sunday maybe still. Sunday now. Yeah. Sunday fly. Friday get visa and Sunday fly. Very nice. So, flat is ready, Bhakti Hemagiri. All flat is ready. You can come. Wow. Even if you like, you come more early. <laughs> <laughs> Everything ready. Huh? So nice. We are very happy.
Yeah. 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 Nice yeah. to see you Thank soon. You. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. You say, very Chaman. Dr. Chaman knows his business. Maybe walking, maybe good day. Very much work. Yes, she's very busy. No, no calling us. Are you learning English? Bhakti Himalayari. No learning. <laughs> yes. <laughs> yes. And Mangala is going to to Italy now. Wow. Wow. Um, you don't know. For one month she is going to Italy. Italy is a very good place. Mm. Thank you. Where are you going, Guru? Oh, Mangara. Mangara? Yes, Mangara. Ah. Yes, Guru Dev. When you are flying to Italy? Uh, <laughs> July, July 21st. Yeah. Wow. Nice. <laughs> Thank you for your mercy. Yananda Maharaj, your uh, many place expansion is going on. <laughs> yes, your expansion. <laughs> I'm nothing, I'm small room they give me to live here. Yeah. <laughs> so uh, very nice. Many, many people go to many places. This is very nice. I'm a gatekeeper, yeah. Thank you, Ben. Yeah. 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 Yeah.